Hurry up, wise. We're starting. This is Faithin speaking. Can everyone hear me? Did we start already? Hang on. The owner of the office next door changed the Wi-Fi password again. Ugh. I need to pay our internet bill real quick. This is Anton from Bellabog Industries. Everything looks and sounds clear. And I've called for a temporary stop on all construction, so there won't be any interruptions this time. Uh, I'm Corin, and I'm here on behalf of Victoria Housekeeping. Um, Master Proxy, you look a little worse for wear. Are you okay? <sighs> I knew I should have tidied myself up a bit. Too late now. It's okay, Wise. By the way, why are you here this time, Corin? Where's Lycon? Uh, Lycon has been taking lip-reading classes, one of which was today. So, I'm standing in for him. Looks like someone is still upset about the last meeting. Okay, all paid. Might as well take an arm and a leg while you're at it, darn profiteers at Tangerine Network. So then, let's get down to business. I've got two pieces of intel to share with everyone today. Good news first. Those larger defense weapons that we speculated about being in Midsummer's warehouses? Well, one really does exist. It holds the key to Hollow C-41's reactivation. As for the bad news, it's already been activated. And sure enough, it was the rookie Hollow Raiders breaking in that did it. Already triggered? Oh, that's rough. Our lead tech, Grace, reckons early-era AIs have poor resistance to ether corruption. Once that defensive weapon falls into a state of deep corruption, it'll become an ethereal soon after. It could be dangerous. If it becomes an ethereal, won't that stimulate further ether activity? Meaning, Hollow C-41 would become a fully active sub-hollow again? Most likely, if we don't stop it in time. The Investigative Association and Public Security are already working to retest ether activity in C-41. If it's not stopped before the results come out, then those living near C-41 won't have to worry about how they'll be spending Camellia Golden Week. That's a heavy price to pay. You say the defense weapon being triggered is bad news, Proxy? Well, I just so happen to think it's good news. Before it was active, we had to deal with both the defense weapons and all the Hollow Raiders fumbling around C-41. But now we can just focus on defeating this one machine. Isn't that better? What a positive way of thinking. I... I hope I can become more like Miss Nicole. True! <clears throat> it's easier to take out one definite bad guy rather than a hundred potential bad guys. I'm at your command, Proxy! Use me however you see fit, and I'll be at your beck and call! Same for me! How could I let some antique defense weapon get between me and my mysterious treasure? <laughs> it's good to hear we can rely on you all. Everyone, the burden of saving the holiday for so many rests on us. Today's your lucky day.
Eliminating target. Target confirmed. Surrender your weapon! Pushing. Move! At your command. Just leave it to me! Based on our latest reports, experts from the White Star Institute, accompanied by the Association's investigators, have completed another Ether activity survey of Companion Hollow C-41, located in the Janus Quarter. These experts have concluded C-41 remains in decline. All travel restrictions for nearby neighborhoods have been lifted, which is undoubtedly great news for the citizens celebrating Camellia Golden Week. And now to weigh in on why the ether activity of Hollow C-41 was fluctuating. We welcome a senior investigator to the studio. Great! C-41's activity is finally declining again, and it's starting to shrink. Our mission was a success! Unfortunately, our own holiday plans are going to suffer. Suggestion. Master can activate my efficient vacation proposal at any time. I almost forgot Fairy was still clinging to that awful vacation plan. In any case, the C-41 situation changed so quickly. I'm just happy the only thing we ended up sacrificing was a holiday. Happy? I'm not happy at all. I spent so much time, money, and connections finding Midsummer's stupid mysterious treasure. So tell me, why does its core vault still have a physical lock? Because we destroyed the security mech, right? And the electronic vault switch attached to it, too. It can't be helped. The machine was the highest level of security in the central warehouse. When it was destroyed, the signal it sent out ruined the circuitry around the core vault. The only way in now is with a physical key. Midsummer Incorporated has been gone for years! How could I possibly get the key to their central warehouse now? Damn it! My mysterious treasure! My gold! My golden week! <laughs> Take it easy, Nicole. We can't change what happened. Why don't you head home and get some rest? Speaking of rest, you can never have too many movies to watch. Wanna borrow a few tapes? <sighs> oh, right. I guess I can't do anything about it. Give me a few videotapes, then. Oh, yeah! I've got this, uh, free trial voucher I like to pay with. Another free trial voucher? How many of those do you have? <laughs>